U.S. President Barack Obama has confirmed the death of U.S. aid worker Peter Kasig, who was held hostage by Islamic State militants in Syria. Obama released his official statement on the latest act of brutality by the terror group while aboard Air Force One on his return from the G20 summit in Brisbane, Australia. Kasig had converted to Islam while in captivity. Obama further praised Kasig as a humanitarian who lost his life in an act of pure evil by IS. In the video released by IS on Sunday, Kasig's head is seen lying in the sand at the feet of an IS militant known by the name of Jihadi John, who is seen holding a knife and saying, This is Peter Edward Kasig, a US citizen of your country. Peter, who fought against Muslims in Iraq, was serving as a soldier in the American army and does not have much to say. His previous cellmates have already spoken on his behalf. The 15-minute video also shows several other hostages kneeling in the desert, with the uniformed men standing behind them. Obama's confirmation comes after thorough examination by authorities following the release of the video by Al-Fakan Media that's controlled by IS.